Man, what a beautiful overworld. It just shows you, like, even years later, they could still make something like this look beautiful and fresh and just interesting. That's why I mean. I like this. Hi. Right in here, princess. Hmm. Hello, sir. Pardon us, but my name is Left. Lady Impa is my colleague, and... Who's that? I'm a very busy man. No time for chatter. Now get... I apologize for the unannounced visit, but please, will only be a moment. No, 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 I'm about to leave. Come back later. If you could just hear us out, I said no. I've got to go save Link. Hmm, hang on here. That's Link's cloak. So why do you have it? Did you see him well? What? Okay, tell me everything. Tell me about the rifts and anything you know about the swordsman. I understand the situation now. Thanks for the explanation, princess. We finally got through to him. This has been bugging me ever since you barged in here. What is that floaty thing? You could see me too. That's strange. Zelda's always been able to, but now both of you can as well? You're telling me we're the only ones who could see you. That's odd. Indeed, such a fascinating and, might I add, adorable creature. Yeah, yeah, sure, but back to the matter at hand. What is it that you and I have in common? We both ended up in rifts and lived to tell the tale. Yeah, so maybe once you go in, it changes you. You can now see them. I guess I should introduce myself. The name's Luberi. I'm Impa's older brother. And the swordsman who saved you is Link. I made his weapon, the Sword of Might. Mr. Luberi, why did you make him a sword? Princess, remember that big, nasty blue fellow who captured you? The sword was for taking him out. See, I spent my time researching Hyrule's history and its rifts. For ages now, rifts have appeared, and sometimes folks have ended up in them. Those unfortunate enough to be pulled into a rift vanish without a trace, after which townsfolk would say they'd been stolen away. Anyhow, Link made his mission to fight the monsters that come crawling out of the rifts. He also tried to prevent folks from going missing, and I've been helping as I'm able to, which is why I made him a sword, one that's effective against rift monsters. The Sword of Might Princess Zelda's wielding is the very one I'd hope will be of use to Link. So Link was helping out with the rifts as well. Plenty of monsters come out of rifts, but that blue one was particularly powerful. I've got a hunch if we take him out, it'll fix the whole people disappearing business. Princess, you shared that Link managed to take the blue guy out, and yet rifts keep coming. Clearly we're missing something. The rift in the forest is gone, but Link's not back. What we need is more information. I may have something useful. When I was taken by the rift in Hyrule Castle, it felt like I was flown somewhere far away. The rift I, pulled into, I was pulled into was at Hyrule Castle, but Princess Zelda found me in a rift in the forest. So how did I end up over there? Rifts don't follow the same rules as your world. Things connect differently inside them. My friends had mentioned something about oversized rifts in other areas. We might end up finding the king and other people in far-off rifts. So maybe Link is somewhere else then. Hey, Zelda. I'm going to fly up high to look for some of the other big rifts. <laughs> no clips. I think I found some. There's no saying where Zelda's father and the others might be, but I did spot some big rifts we could go explore. Okay, one to the west and one pretty far off. Okay. I marked them on your map. If we fix the rifts, we may be able to save your father and the others. So let's get to work. Princess Zelda, I must insist that you refrain from going to any more rifts. It's far too dangerous. That's up to her to decide, Master. I mean, she's the only one capable of mending the rifts. During this time in crisis and high rule, we all have to play our parts, Princess Zelda included. Make a salient point, Mr. Lubery. Princess, I urge you to go and try to the other rifts. They're the only one who could fix them and save all the people who've gone missing. Minister, you stay here and help me investigate the rifts. Oh, of course. Investigations are my specialty. <sighs> Princess, the rifts marked by Tri are located in the Gerudo Desert and Jabul Waters. Let me know if you require further information. Alright, Princess, I leave it to you to find the King, General Wright, and Link. I almost forgot. The sword you got there, pretty sure I can make it even more powerful than it is. We'll have to do more research on it, though, so talk to me later if you're interested. Okay, the rift. I'll be here helping Mr. Luberry investigate the rifts so we can better support you. 
Uh, tell me about the rifts. Right now, there are large rifts in Jabul waters and the Gerudo Desert. Jabul, like Jabun, Jabu Jabu a little bit. Yeah, okay. Jabul waters is northeast of here. It's home to the Zora, who are remarkable swimmers. The residents are divided into the Sea Zora and the River Zora. On the coast, soon after entering Jabul waters, there is a small, highly in fishing village. I'm sure the villagers there will have interesting morsels to share with you about the local yeah. area. Gerudo Desert is west of us. It's a harsh land with high temperatures and sandstorms. Skilled warriors known as the Gerudo live in a town far into the desert. I almost forgot they're all women, not a man among them. They're often on patrol near the desert entrance, so you may want to yeah. talk to them there. Okay. Uh, I keep thinking about his match to see the general and Link. I hope that by mending the rifts, they'll be returned to us. Uh, Alright. You want to chat about the sword? As I mentioned before, the Sword of Might is my craftsmanship. For a while now, I've been researching a type of crystal that's sometimes left behind from the rifts. In my research, I discovered that it's highly effective against rift monsters. It appears you have some of that blue crystal with you. I ended up calling it the Might Crystal. It's where I forged the Sword of Might from, in fact. During my investigations into the rifts, I met Link, who's from Suthorn Village. I made the sword for him, and the rest is history. Link's made good use of the sword. Meanwhile, I've continued forging things with my crystals. See that machine in the corner? I designed it to enhance the sword. Looking at the sword, it seems like it's lost some of its power. Once we enhance it, it'll be back to its original state. We should give it a try. All you need to do is bring me some my crystals. Okay. What do you want to enhance? My energy or my sword? probably should hold off right because then we could get level two or a bigger gauge i don't know we could hold on now it's no rush i guess we're supposed to go to gerudo next since it's so close here we go wanted princess zelda oh my god just like when link would, would run around and what was it How, like, Link would run around and, uh, what was that, Link to the Pass? Alright, goodbye. Crawl, Chula. I guess, yeah, we just go west. Why not? Bonk him. Oh, my God. Hit him. Hit him. The crow took a hit from an axe? No, it didn't. That's ridiculous. Okay. Crow echo. We're in dry, dry desert now. Crows mug you, basically. Okay. Guess we could might as well sleep before we continue because I lost a good eh, one heart. A good one heart just from a crow tackling you, basically. The sand! The endless sand!
I mean, it is good to see the Gerudo in more games. I'm sure there's a rift we could get into somewhere around here, but this desert seems really big. I wonder where we should start looking. I guess for now I could check the area around with the biggest rift. The monsters just keep coming. I'm completely worn out. I hear you, but if we keep at it, then that big rift should start shrinking. We could do this. We'll get rid of that rift and take back Gerudo's sanctum. Get him. Okay, what the fuck? <sighs> Bruh. Hello, help me. Thank you. The Eruroda? And a warm pepper. Alright, it seems like there's small rifts as well that you could also hit up. Can we maybe set a pin? Yeah, here we go. There's a chest there. Maybe I was supposed to talk with them. Hi. Rifts have shown up across, all across the desert ever since our sanctum got pulled into one. I'm still in shock about the sanctum. We got to get rid of the rifts as soon as possible. Oh. Monsters that crawl out the rifts are all tough. I'm exhausted from all the fighting. Well, I've been thinking. I heard the rift in Suthorn Forest is gone now. I hope the ones here in the desert get fixed up soon, too. Then maybe we could catch a break. Yeah. Our town is west of here. You should check it out. But everyone's on edge due to the rifts. We've heard there's a lot of trouble outside the desert, too. But we've got our hands full here. No. Yeah, okay. Maybe later there's something here, but for right now we can't enter it at all, so, okay. We just have to head west. Can we even get west? Yeah, south. The Oasis. Now every day I see a, another Hylian in Gerudo Desert. If you're wondering about that tent, there's a Gerudo, doing, a Gerudo researching something or other in there. I'm sure she could use a hand if you felt inclined. Might help take your mind off all the rifts. Uh. If you ever get lost in the desert, make sure to check your map. The map won't do you much good in the middle of a sandstorm. Yeah. That cloak. Apologies for my intensity. You reminded me of someone else. You see, I nearly got pulled into a rift a long time ago. At the time, a swordsman wearing a very similar cloak rescued me. He took out wave after wave of monsters as they swarmed from the rift. It was quite the sight. It's actually the reason I decided to become a soldier. I wanted to be strong like him someday. So Link, Link's already been going around doing stuff. Oh, hey, it's a Deku shrub. I haven't seen these in a long while. What would my branch of the smoothie shop? This is, this is a place where you can craft your own freezing taste bud pleasing smoothies. The process is simple. You pick two ingredients, I blend them together. They boost the healing effect. Resistance to cold. Boost the effect of other ingredients. Makes the drinker glow. And why don't we do grapes and this? You got it! Some of this, some of that. Mix it all up with a teensy pinch of... Alrighty. Your smoothie, madame. So we have a drink menu, gotcha. Holy shit, that's incredibly good. Hope you like it. I add that recipe to the menu so you'll be able to order the same thing next time if you like. Which actually is giving me an idea. My siblings and I are new to the smoothie game. And to keep hold over the market, we're opening branches all over Hyrule. But that's been so much work, we haven't had time to come up with new smoothie concepts. So what would you say to a joint venture? You make recipes, we handle the business side. Come up with 10 recipes out of ingredients from your travels and we should be in good shape. We'll even throw in a reward. Sounds great, huh? Thanks for the help. Before you go, my siblings are running smoothie shops in other places, too. We're all sending ingredients from our local regions to the main shop back home. If you run into any of my siblings, give them my best, okay? Okay. 
Mm. Where, where, where? Facet doesn't know, and she's the chief's aide, so where are they? Oh. Just muttering to myself. Sorry about that. I'm Tormali, an Oasis guard. Guarding the Oasis is my main priority, but I've been tasked with another mission recently. I take it you're not from here, are you? In which case, you might be able to help me. In your travels, have you ever seen tiles that could fly through the air? According to my boss's research, ancient Gerudo used them to chase off unwelcome guests. I've been scouring the desert in search of these towels, but so far nothing. Maybe you'll have better luck, though. If you could find one, could you bring it to me? The flying tile. Yeah. Hello, Wanderer. Welcome to the Tough Mango Plant Lab. Here at the lab, we create a effective cultivation in preparation for potential food crises. My current field of study is on tough mangoes. After much research, I've successfully developed tough mango seeds that grow at a rapid rate. Showing the results of my work should help countless people in the future. There's just one little problem. This mango plant withers as quickly as it grows, so I'm unable to harvest fast enough. I can't compile data if I can't harvest properly. At this rate, I'll run out of funding for my project. In response, I've begun enlisting folks to help with a little game of Mango Rush. Oh, uh, there's a participation fee? No, not now. Here you go, a better bed. The soft bed probably heals more or heals faster. I guess we just keep going to Gerudo Town then. That didn't take long. I wonder where the sandstorm's supposed to come from. <laughs> they keep saying, there's a sandstorm! The sandstorm! And I just walk in. You warp here using the map. Was I seeing things? This might sound a little odd, but do you believe in tornado ghosts? See, I got caught up in a sandstorm recently when this tornado comes whirling at me. It was hard to see clearly with all the sand, but I swear I saw a face in the tornado. It must have been a ghost, but why would it be chasing me? Did I anger the spirits or something? Was it real? Did I imagine it? If I could see it again, I'd know for sure. Oops. Oops, my bad. My bad. Hello there, highly and curious about me. I'm one of many Gerudo soldiers. I'm off duty at the moment, but that doesn't mean I'm going to slack in my training. My confidence comes from my agility and grace. You hold my skill. Ha <laughs> ha! What's with the blank expression? It's almost as if you don't find me impressive. Well, then I'll prove my skill to you in hand to hand tag. Ready to play tag? I'll give you something. No, uh, not now. Because I don't know if I could catch up, so. Highly, and I'm impressed you made it all the way here through the desert. You must be quite the explorer to come all this way, which reminds me. Oh. I'm looking for these elusive tumbleweeds. Maybe you've seen them on your travels. You can find them blowing across the sand here in Gerudo Desert, but the pesky things roll out of reach, and if you try to grab one, they fall apart. Uh. The more I think about how elusive they are, the more obsessed I get. All I want to do is spend my time observing one of the tumbleweeds closely. Uh. If I manage to destroy everyone I found, my dream, is to observe, my dream to observe them is so out of uh. reach. If you bring me my heart's desire, you will be well rewarded. So you have to grab one with try and then bring it all the way over here. There you go. Ah, we can't bring it up steps. Oh, that's going to be brutal.
There you go. Got it. Nice. Oh. You brought me one. Thank you so, so, so much. Oh. Seeing the delicate dried foliage explains why they tend to break so easily. No, wait. It's not dried. This is just a particular type of plant matter. What are these pokey bits? The more I look at it, the more fascinating it is. I spent all day gazing at this beautiful, magnificent tumbleweed. My dream has come true. My wish granted. Thank you, kind one. Please take these. Alright, two mite crystals. They have such peculiar shapes, don't they? I hope you enjoy observing them for many hours. Alright, let's try this then. Rudo tag training. When you're running out, if you tag me, you win. You can even block the path if you want. That shouldn't really stop anyone. None of this should, but whatever. Tag. So fast, even faster than me, impossible. My, my, you are indeed very capable. Your legs carry you like one who has traveled across many regions. You have inspired me. Here you are, as promised. Chili cactus. Can use to recover hearts. Okay. Keep trying until I'm an invincible warrior. Thank you for the inspiration. <laughs> the Versa Guru Desert don't seem to be getting any smaller. No, that's concerning to hear. Uh? You need something? Outsiders aren't allowed to enter here. Go on, scram. appear we warriors have been fighting non-stop resting in shifts i'm off duty today but i might do a quick patrol on my walk pitch in a bit more yeah so little one who do you think will be the next chief you think it'll be dona uh. i help you it's rude to stare you know all right nothing to grab here it's an entire village of lonely cat women shocker Weather sure is nice today, isn't it? On days like this, I feel like I could sleep forever. Yeah, I know that feeling. Just want to chill, relax, stretch. You know, you get that spinal column stimulation. Man, that hits so good. I know that exact feeling. Word for word, point for point, bar for bar, line for line, shot for shot. Are you serious? We're gonna have a crazy ass stealth section. Dude, wait a minute. That's one of the elephants from uh Wind Waker. Yeah. Huh. Okay, lore enthusiast, get on it. That's like one of the exact kind of elephant statues that was in uh, the Zora Temple. Could be a coincidence. Alright, so whatever this is, we're gonna need to wait. Everyone in town is super tense because a rift appeared in Gerudo's sanctum. Have you been there? It's a site that's sacred to our people. It's just southeast of town. A giant rift swallowed up the sanctum and... Wait, maybe I shouldn't be telling you this. Okay, well, let's, let's actually go there now ourselves. Yep. 
I keep thinking that, what is that one sound? That one song, that Terra song from like Final Fantasy VI is about to play. It kind of opens up the same way, at least. When you're walking through the caves and shit. Yeah, anyone who's wondering, I did a playthrough of Final Fantasy VI recently. It's one of my favorite RPGs of all time. Oh no. Wow, he swung backwards and hit him. Okay, nice. Basically, he can't do anything to a bat mobile. Or I'm sorry, a bat mobile can't do anything to him. He's too brawlic. He just swings really terribly. Thank you. Oops, I did not mean to do that. It was a mistake. Although I probably should use it to kill these fish. We got re-deads. Okay. Okay. Just rupees. We do. We need one more piece of heart. We can't find it. Huh? My friends are nearby. I can create a rift entrance beneath here. Come on, Zelda. Oh, you can't come with me, can you? What should we do? We could try talking to her. Maybe she knows a way you could get through the sand. Yeah, not everyone can no-clip, my friend. You're not a Gerudo. What do you want? Get through the sand? Uh, no, you aren't getting past me. Only those authorized by our chief are allowed entry. Now go home. I don't think she's going to move. Oh! Uh -huh. ah! What was that? Is someone hurt? I, I have to stay at my post, otherwise I go see what's going on. Uh-oh. Is she okay? Get him. Bop him. Bop him. Thank you. Nice. What happened? The monsters, they're gone. Did you defeat them for me? Seems they pose no threat to you, and yet I, a seasoned warrior, couldn't handle them. Thank you. You saved my life. I suppose I should introduce myself. I'm Dona, the captain of the Gerudo Warriors. What is your name? Nice to meet you, Zelda. So what brings you out this way? Ooh. I see, I see. You're traveling around, fixing rifts, uh-huh. You're fixing rifts? Pardon my shock, it's just that the rifts have been causing us serious trouble lately. We've heard that taking care of the monsters would also take care of the rifts, but it hasn't. The rifts haven't gotten any smaller, and the monsters keep coming, without end, it seems. If we could rid ourselves of these cursed rifts, then no one, nobody else would end up getting hurt. Hey, Zelda. You think she might know how to get you under the sand? Is everything all right, Zelda? Ooh. You want to burrow under the sand? Well, the sanctum is beneath us. I understand now. You think that if you could get rid of the rift, you could get into the oh. sanctum. Normally, the entrance to the sanctum is where we're standing. But as you probably noticed, it's flooded with sand now, so nobody can get inside. Oh. If you want to get into the sanctum, we'd first need to clear out the entrance. Oh. Sanctum was pulled into a large rift after that tons of monsters began swarming out of the entrance to the sanctum. At that point, we blocked up the entrance, trapping the monsters inside. Ooh. Ooh. A soldier is guarding the back entrance. If we could go through there, we could clear the sand out. Of course, doing that would release the monsters as well. Our chief gave orders to keep it blocked for safety, so I'm not sure how to proceed. Ooh. I see. Ah. In order to get rid of the rift, you need to get into the sanctum, right? 
Understood. Well then, it sounds like we need to discuss things with the Chief. You saved my life, so I'll do all I can to help you. And if you're able to get rid of the rift, that means our warriors wouldn't be injured or won't be injured anymore. Let's meet up at the palace in Gerudo Town. It's just northwest of here. Normally only Gerudo are allowed in the palace, but I'll put in a word for you ahead of time. Alright, Zelda, I'll be waiting for you there. Okay. Let's warp. Was I seeing things? What do they have in the item shop? Another piece of heart, maybe? Uh, what is this? Aye. They prevent the wear from sinking in quicksand. <sighs> so we need 400 rupees to afford it. Chief Sira, I have a report concerning the blocked-up entrance to the Sanctum. As predicted, the number of monsters is dwindling. Yeah. Zelda, I've been waiting for you. Huh. Chief, this is the Hylian I was telling you about. With her help, we may be able to rid the giant rift here in our desert. But in order to do that, she'll need to get into the Sanctum. If she could get rid of the rift as she claims, we'll finally be done with this long battle. To this end, will you please restore the entrance to the Sanctum? Mm -hmm. Captain Dona, do you comprehend what it is you are asking? If you recall, after the Sanctum was consumed by the Rift, the Surgeon Monsters began. For the town's safety, we blocked the Sanctum's entrance to prevent monsters from pouring out. Since then, we've been eradicating the rest of the monsters, which will fix the Rift. After that, we'll reclaim the Sanctum. That was our plan. Or, oh, I'm sorry, that was the plan, or have you forgotten? Of course not, Facet. Many of my warriors have been injured, and the monsters keep coming. To top it off, we've defeated countless monsters, yet the rift doesn't appear to be shrinking at all. We should be acting with urgency to be rid of the rift as soon as possible, and Zelda can help. You can't expect us to trust this total stranger. We don't even know where she comes from. You're the chief's daughter. I'm shocked by your severe lack of judgment. Peace, Facet. Pardon my words, Chief Sira, but I... Dona, I understand the concern you feel for the warriors. I feel each injury to our warriors as though it was my own. That said, have you seen this Hylian eradicate a rift? I... You've only just met this stranger yourself. How can you tell us to trust her? Well, I... Chief Sira, it seems further discussion is unnecessary. Now is not the time to be entertaining strangers in their claims. I will prove what Zelda says is true. You'll be wasting your time. This Hylian is clearly deceiving you. She saved my life. How dare you speak of her like that? I trust Zelda and I will prove that she could get rid of rifts. No matter how many monsters they fight, the rift isn't going to go away on its own. Dona is correct about this, so why won't they trust us? That's why we probably go to that smaller rift uh, over to the northeast. Alright. You there, Hylian. Uh, Captain Dona left a message for you on her way out. She mentioned she's heading to the Oasis, and she'd like you to join her there. To get to the Oasis, head due east when you leave town. You can't miss it. It's all she shared for you. Okay, easy. <laughs> Glad we got the warps. So none of the rifts are shrinking yet. I see. Thank you for your report. Get some rest before you return to patrol the rifts. Thanks for coming, Zelda. Let's talk over here. Ah. The water here is so beautiful, don't you think? This place holds many memories for me. The chief, my mother, used to play here with me when I was little. She would tell me to look at the serene water to keep my mind and heart calm like the water. Basset took up my training rather than my mother because mother was busy as chief. Basset trained the others, too. Thanks to her and mother, we are the Gerudo you see here today. I have so much respect for the both of them, but I can't stand by and watch things get worse. Obviously, Facet has been taken into the rift, and the mask that they're wearing is to cover up the red eyes. But you already knew that, so, you know. It is what it is. 
I wonder how we can prove to my mother and Fissette that you're being honest. Aside from the big rift at the Sanctum, there are also three small rifts elsewhere in the desert. I'd like for you to see if you can get rid of any of them. They're in Southern Oasis Ruins, Ancestors Cave of Rest, and Southern Gerudo Desert. Okay, we're good. Trust you. And if you get rid of a rift, I'm sure the chief will trust you too. Oop, you can swim. There you go. Darkna is really good. There you go. Now we can show it to her. The torn, torn, tornando, tornando. Again, keeping with that Link's Awakening vibe. These look like Mario enemies and the Sand Piranha. Nice! Good combo there. The Club Borblin. That is a terrifying cry. Oh, you lose legit life in this. Okay. The boomerang borblin. Sometimes I think they just make up new kinds of bokoblin. Constantly bokoblin, moblin. All that for peppers. I mean, obviously the temperature mechanics from like Breath of the Wild are gonna come back, so. You know, we're gonna need it. Bro, Darkna is putting in mega work. <laughs> the beetle. All right, get him. The Beetle Mound. I guess if we need to make like a steady stream of enemies. Okay. One Might Crystal. I wonder why the Sword of Might and not the Master Sword. Torches in here have all gone out. What am I going to do? With the rift in here, I can't get near the grave, so I can't light the torches. Without them lit, our ancestors won't be able to rest peacefully. That same sound effect when you move something sounds like the floor masters. Zelda and Wind Waker. There you go.
I just want to get this one. As usual, I just want to collect it. Wait, can we? Okay, here we go. What is it? The mole? The whole... Oh, the hall mill. Alright, that's it. Well, they say keep it simple, right? It's nothing too crazy. Uh, how do I go back up? Oh, you know what do we use? The spider. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm just fucked. Oh, I didn't even get that either. Nice. <laughs> Man, the Zelda 2 segments are just funny. to recover hearts was it dude it's resident evil what the hell <laughs> you eat it it's a full heal i wonder why the shell being gold indicates a higher quality like i don't know we wouldn't say that brown eggs are like i don't know I'm thinking too hard about it Brown eggs are nice, though, I won't lie. Oh. Peace once more. Uh. No, we have seen you before. Well, thank you for lighting the torches. <laughs> but the fire is burning, we can rest peacefully now. Yeah. Don't tell my descendant that all is well. Oh. Torches are lit again. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Yeah. So you lit them, but how? Found a secret passageway to the grave. I didn't know one existed. And a Groot over there wanted you to talk to me. That's so weird. I thought I was the only one here. <laughs> uh -huh. Anyway, thanks for the help. I really appreciate it. I'm sure the ancestors are happy too. Thank you. I'm not seeing anywhere I could create an opening into the rift so we won't be able to get in here. Alright, that's fine. Hang on. Where is this? This is just in the middle? Yeah, okay. Never found this. Uh-oh. Quicksand! Yeah, I don't know why we can't have a Zelda game that has, like, all the different races in it, too. You know, like... Koroks, all that stuff. I think that would be kind of cool. get probably like the wind blower or whatever this is supposed to be the wind cannon echo there 
go. I wonder why they made that a hold ability, of all things. Oh my god. Where's Dark Nut? There you go. Oh my god, it doesn't even hurt. You just only hit them once. Well, this dude bodied the shit out of him. Nice. Dude, the Dark Nut is seriously gonna carry me the whole game. Unless we, there's like a better Dark Nut. Rock? Rock Tatoes. Yeah, you get like the Gorons, the Rito, the Zora, the Gerudo, the Koroks. All right, we get everybody involved. Technically, humans and Hylians are also supposed to be different as well. Alright, we could level up the sword, actually. Maybe we should go do that. Yeah, that might be a good thing to do. Let's level it up. but I might get something to eat, but I would like to maybe do like two dungeons today just because. Okay. My sword. Very nice. Sword of Maya is now level two. They don't even really talk about it, you know? They're just like, yeah, yeah, you know, thanks for leveling it up. He doesn't really say, like, wait, why is it still level one? I have no idea. Maybe, like, a level one gauge, I guess? Are you hanging in there? Yes, sort of. Actually, actually, no, I'm not. We're defeating wave after wave of these things, but they just keep coming. Huh? When did you get here? It's not safe here. Monsters keep coming after us. <laughs> just like that. Oh, my muscles are locking up at this point. Oh, wow, that gets you even over here. It even frightened the Dark Nut. But don't worry, the Dark Nut's got it under control. So I have to get some earmuffs for Zelda. So she doesn't have to hear it. <laughs> wow, you're pretty strong, girl. Girl! Can't believe we're the ones being saved. Well, at least the monsters seem to be mopped up for the time being. Now, if the rift would just go away, I'm all worn out from the relentless fighting. Let's take a break for a bit. Thank you for helping us. You're a lifesaver. Can't create a rift entrance here, so we won't be able to get into this one. All right? So we have to do the other one. All right, so it's right south of uh, Gerudo Town. No, what's wrong? We've been keeping post here at the rift without any rest. We ran out of water while fighting the monsters. We're about ready to collapse. I'm so thirsty I can't even move anymore. You have to drink something right away. Water won't be enough. You need a drink that can both hydrate and provide nutrients. That sounds like a plug for an advertiser. Can you run to the smoothie shop and buy a cactus smoothie? 
They'll make one for you if you give them two chili cacti here. I'll stay here and keep an eye on them, so please go get the drink, Zelda. Alright. Oops. Let's actually go quickly turn in um, this quest, the face. Ghost! Wait, it's not a ghost or a tornado, it's a monster called a Tornando? Actually, now they get a closer look at it, it doesn't even look like a ghost, does it? It just chased me because I didn't... Uh, because it wanted to send me flying across the desert. I didn't anger any spirits. I've really been overthinking things. Well, that clears that up, I suppose. Thank you so much for helping me out. Here you go. What was that, milk? Fresh milk. How can I call myself a Gerudo when I'm so spooked by something that wasn't even a ghost? If the chief finds out how easily spooked I am, I'll get a real talking to... But, I mean, we're all scared of something. Can't really fault a person for having fears. Okay. Let's go back to the smoothie shop. Two chilled cacti. Yes, there you go. Your smoothie. You got a cactus smoothie. It's blue. Ugh. Come back soon. So who's this? That's obviously like another shrub, probably. This really does start out like the dry, dry desert one. Yeah. The cactus smoothie. Thank you, Zelda. All right, everyone, drink up. Whew, I feel rejuvenated. Oh, I feel so much better already. Thank you. Now I can get back to patrolling. My goodness, I'm so glad you're all feeling refreshed. There's nowhere around here for me to create an entrance into the rift. Zelda, how has it gone so far? Were you able to get rid of any of the rifts? You couldn't get rid of them, which means getting you into the Sanctum is the only way we'll solve things. But we don't have any way to do that right now. Huh. Captain Dona. We received a message from Lady Facet. She wants to know whether or not you've been able to see evidence of Zelda's powers yet. She commands that you bring the Hylian and provide her with a status uh. update. So be it. Huh? We haven't found a way to prove your ability yet, but we better go check in regardless. I'll go ahead to the palace. Come and meet me there later, please. Actually, before we do this, let's test out that bed. Yep, this one gives a full heart. There you go. So the only thing you really should do is you should, um... You should use the beds out of combat and then drink if you really need to in combat, where obviously you can't dodge and stuff. Huh. Oh, that's not a mask. It looked like a mask before. Tell us, Captain Dona, have you managed to find proof she could fix the rifts? No, not yet, but if you would listen to what she has to say, then you'll... So you've returned to us with nothing. After swearing you would find proof of her capabilities, clearly this is some sort of joke. This stranger has you entirely deceived. Yeah. No, she doesn't. For what reason would she be deceiving me? To what end? She's been working with me to prove that she could get rid of the rift since we last spoke. What, would she be running all over the desert like that simply to have a laugh at my expense? I know she's telling the truth, and I'm willing to give her the opportunity to prove it to you, too. Can't stand by my, while my warriors, my friends, are being wounded on the battlefield. I trust Zelda, and I know she could get rid of the rifts. We just have to give her the chance. I'll take full responsibility for whatever happens. Please, Chief Sierra, let us enter the, sa the sanctum. The sanctum. Dona, are you willing to risk your honor as a warrior to place your trust in this person? Huh? I am. You've grown so strong, my daughter. I, too, can no longer stand by while my people suffer. Seeing you put your honor on the line inspires me to place my own trust in this person. 
Chief Sira, you cannot be serious. If we remove the sand from the sanctum, we will once again be overwhelmed by monsters. Huh. Do you forget that I'm a warrior, Facet? I will hold the monsters at bay. <laughs> You're being ridiculous. You really think you can hold back waves of monsters on your own? Bye. She won't be on her own. <laughs> huh? Mm -hmm. Why are you here? Uh. We overheard your discussion. Chief Sira, Lady Facet, this young lady has helped all of us. She helped me at the cave of our ancestors, and she aided us as well. If she's able to rid us of these horrible rifts, then we'll do all we can to support her. Captain Dona, we stand at your side. Hmm. Facet, you heard our warriors. Are you now willing to hear this Zelda out? Of course not. What are you saying? What a wretched excuse for a chief. She's trying to s deceive you. To take advantage of you, can you not see her true character? Guards, this girl has ill intentions and is here to deceive us, Gerudo. Throw her in jail at once. Facet, what are you doing? Chief Sir, we've got trouble. What is it? A rift at the ruins in the eastern desert grew, and a bunch of our warriors were taken by it. Take me there at once, soldier. Yes, Chief Sierra. Onward, warriors! Of course. Jusira, please wait. You can't go rushing into the fray like this. So ill-equipped. Ah, uh, fuck you. I will. <laughs> the rift expanded. I might be able to create an entrance there, then. Let's follow them. So they said eastern desert, so over here, yeah. Alright. I'm sorry, it was the other way. It even sounds like a Mario enemy. <laughs> Our warriors are inside this rift. Don't get too close. We've got to save them, but how? Beset, following your counsel, we have tirelessly worked to defeat the monsters. Tell me then, why has this rift gotten bigger? Perhaps we have yet to defeat enough monsters. Chief Sir, it's dangerous here. Let's return to the palace with haste. Don't be absurd. Our soldiers have been taken. Do you really think I'd leave them behind? Will I... I think I can create an entrance here. Stand back, Zelda. <gasps> Zelda, is that... Oh. You can enter the rift here and get rid of it, and you'll be able to get my friends out too. Wow, thank goodness. Please, do whatever you need to. Alright, well, if we need to get more healing, I guess we could always backtrack and just pick up some... This is the still world, but this area isn't connected to a big rift. Even so, I can sense my friends here. They're not moving at all. I get the feeling they're trapped or something. If we rescue them, we'll be able to mend the rift. I sense my friends in five different areas. They're somewhere in this area here. Let's find them and rescue them. Yeah, it's the things from A Link to the Past. The ones, uh, the little, like, huts that you're supposed to go into. So what should I do for this? complete shock i wonder if this is related to the what is it the realm the realm the the, the twilight the skyward sword one where you go in the, the silent realm i wonder if the still world is similar to that how oh. 
wonder if they're meant to be similar in some way. What? I wasn't even in it. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, is this one a bust too? How the fuck am I supposed to do this? idea how to begin doing this. I think I might have to leave. There might be something I'm supposed to get. Well, we only know where two of them are, so there must be something we can do. Am I supposed to move with one of those, like, up? I guess I hang off it. Yeah. Maybe I wait for it to come crashing down, and I hang off it and get, and get taken up. That's one. I don't know how to get to the other, though. Yeah. Oh, we could just move them. Oh, good lord. Yeah! Yeah! Let me get my health back. Don't worry, we'll still use the old bed. We're just not going to use it right now. Yeah, I wonder if I could capture one of these. I have no idea. I, I don't know what I'm going to have to do for this. I Can we blow using the wind cannon? funny, honestly. Well, the rest of these float. Is this like some wily e. Coyote contraption I just made? Yeah, I don't know what the fuck you're supposed to do here. I guess you could make, like, something reasonably tall. So we can make, like, a shrub. Yeah. 
How would this even work, bro? That shrub would have to be the last thing I create, right? Yeah, now this doesn't work, though. Well, that's two. I don't know where the hell we're supposed to go from here. <laughs> oh, here we go. That should be enough. surprised that even hurts you. I'm watching some serious Fire Emblem gameplay right here. Okay. They're pulling no punches, man. Look at the crazy shit you gotta do. Like, how am I supposed to get across here? Thing over this way. So maybe there's a way to scale walls? Can we use this thing? I don't think there's a way to use it. Not here. Oh. I'm over here struggling. for a horizontal thing because I, I can't use a bed because I don't think there's enough room here uh now I've really done it sticking out of this thing that I'm supposed to use to get across. I don't have anything that goes in sand. And I don't I don't know if there's like a way to jump and place something below you like Minecraft style. I don't know if you could do that in this game. Excellent. I don't is that like a, a control that you could do that's outside of the difficulty? Hero mode. Oh my god. This game has a hero mode, bro. Uh, bind, no, sword fighter form, target, spin, action, yeah, I don't, overhead view, I guess, no. Oh my god. Well, the good news is I've completely neutralized this fucking enemy. Maybe not. Maybe I've jinxed it. Huh? 
How do I break a rock? Oh, okay. <laughs> I was about to say, we don't have bombs. Like, I, I give them this. This is the first Zelda game where you really have to think about every single puzzle the game gives you. Like, this is, this is pretty brutal, man. And here I was thinking this was just going to be like a chibi, lighthearted, just shit post. Instead, I, I've been thrown into a fucking exam. Where my brain is being constantly juiced. Now I have to actually finish doing something. Which I guess I don't have to finish it today, but like I would like to. There we go. Who's that? The real facet. Yeah. It's not facet, but she was just outside. I wonder why she's in here. Da -da -da. How could this happen? Found all my friends in this area. Now we can mend this rift. Why are you the only one that seems to have, like, legs? Friends shared some of their power with me. Only a part of the way? Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, my God. We're going to need, what was that, like a fifth? Let's go back to your world now. Zelda! Oh, where am I? Last I remember, I was pulled into a rift. Oh, you're awake. I'm, I'm so relieved everyone's back safely. She really did it. The rift, it's... It's gone! We saw it with our own eyes. What astonishing powers. Facet, where are you going? We shouldn't leave the palace on garden. I must hurry back. Oh... What happened to me? No. Facet? There are two of you? Chisira, Captain Dona, what has happened? We're wondering the same. How did you get here? I was I was looking into the rifts here in the desert. And and then oh yes, I was pulled into a rift. I see. Chief Sira. I recommend extreme caution. She came out of the rift after all. She could be some kind of monster. Yes, that's what she is. You don't actually think I trust you, do you? Ah! You're not going anywhere! Oh my god, struck her down! Damn! Where did she go? She vanished? So she was a fraud after all. Facet made many questionable remarks ever since the rifts appeared. She spoke of a legend that promised defeating the monsters would eliminate the rifts. Eh. Burying the entrance to the sanctum was also her idea. She only suggested it once she had heard that the rift in the forest had been eradicated. Now that I reflect upon it, she must have intended to keep Zelda away from the rift. What? But why? Uh. Because she didn't want the rifts to be fixed. All of her deceits were to that end. Uh. Zelda, although we were deceived by the false facet, I apologize for how we treated you. You have my permission to restore the entrance to the sanctum and you have my blessing. No, it is selfish for me to ask, but you must use your power to help me and my people. Alright. Thank you so much, Chief. The entrance to the sanctum sits at the base of a quicksand flow in the southern desert. The cave that drained the sand was plugged, causing the flow to submerge the entrance. Go and speak to the guard at the cave and tell her what has transpired. Yes, Chief Sierra. We did it. Once you're ready, please head to the Sanctum. Yeah, I guess we might as well make some drinks, even though the drinks are way overpowered now. I, I guess we might as well make a couple, right? 
just so we have something we could use to heal on this fly, right? <coughs> that sounds like that ghost from Luigi's Mansion, the butler. Crazy, I'm like hearing these weird sound effects. I've been playing games too long. I just hear it in my head. I get teleported to my childhood. Love that feeling. No, actually, I lied. I fucking hate it. Boosts healing effect by a lot. Like, is this even worth using? This feels like a waste. Well, I could just use beds. I don't, I don't have enough hearts. How many rupees do I have? Not enough. I, I can't get the quicksand shoes. So I guess that'll have to wait till way later. Inform the situation. The plug stopping the quicksand is just through here. The place is storming with monsters. I haven't been able to get past them. Think all that uh, to think that all that needed to be done was pull the plug to drain the sand. So we need to pull that plug so we can get to the rift entrance. Let's go. That's not the plug. Uh, throw a pot. these things. I forget what they're called. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Alright, immediately demorph. A little bit of a waste. Ow, not a big deal. Give those. Actually, wait, no. I lied. My brother in Christ, this menu is getting way out of control now. Okay. Ow, that does a lot of damage. All right, where's where's Dark Nut? Get in here. Yo! Chopped him the fuck up! Very nice. Should've just done that first. Whoops. There you go. Actually, this is fine. Yeah, is A ever going to be used, now that I think about it, besides just confirm? Maybe. A uh, trampoline! Oh my god, I didn't place it where I needed it to go. What the fuck? Oh. 
How do I get past this? Fuck. Okay, well, you might be able to really... Oops, I keep doing... Why keep... There might be a way to get past it. Let me get my hearts back. How do you do this? Same thing again. We have to time it as soon as it slams into the wall. We have to time the hold, really. This is definitely not how to do it, for sure. Oh, my God. Okay, whatever. Fuck it. Just take the hit. Sure. So it wasn't even worth it in the long run, either. He pose across. What the fuck? What is going on in this game? <laughs> Actual T pose. Yo, this game is great. Hold it up top. Oh, weird. Okay. Oh, you could kill them? I didn't even know. What are these things called again? Irox? Pathblade? No, that's that's. I don't think they're usually called that. Here we go. So I know exactly. No, I, I keep doing that by accident. I keep thinking that they're on different things, like they were in Breath of the Wild. They are absolutely fucking not. Okay. Uh, maybe we use beds. Beds have never let me down. Not that one, the other one. Probably have to do it from down here. It's a two. Did I make it shorter? Wait, what? No, I, I debated myself. I thought I made it shorter somehow. There we go. That's all I need to do. Shit. 
T pose. T pose of power. Okay, we have to hit it when it slams the wall. So we have to. There you go. Now we T pose. Was it a black Gibdo? I got a shortcut. Go. Go. Go, my Beyblades. How much HP does this thing have? Thank you. Gibdo level two. Yeah, the Dark Knight is just broken. There's so many attacks just bounce right off of it. Like no other enemy like it in the game, basically. At least so far. And that's why it's so strong. Okay. Do we miss anything by any chance? I think we got. Yeah, this isn't even like a real cave or a real dungeon. Oh boy, one more. <laughs> one more full dungeon. Gerudo Sanctum. I can create an entrance here. Stand back. Person in a green tunic, Zelda. Wasn't that Link? Yeah, I, I guarantee you it was not. 100%. It's crazy how much the addition of a jump button changes everything about this game. Just like having a default jump button changes Zelda so much because now there's vertical there's verticality makes it very nice okay can I warp here he warp in and out of a dungeon I don't think so right yeah all right we do not have the map so we just have to look oh it's the tiles here we go Flying tile echo. Yeah, we need we need that for some quests. I forget where. <laughs> Usually the easiest thing in a Zelda game, you just hold up your shield and nothing hits you. I supposed to do here okay 
Never mind. Yeah, you're not gonna find probably any like items or something in this game. You know, like how usually you play a Zelda game, you find like a definitive item inside of the mid boss, or you know, like the mid boss room that changes how you interact with the dungeon. I, I don't think we're gonna really have that much here, to be completely honest with you. I think this game is more about like the puzzle solving aspect, and everything else is kind of like secondary to that. Like, yeah, they they have some combat, but I don't really think it's gonna be something we're gonna see a ton of. Just in general. What the fuck are these things? I usually never make an attack like this in a Zelda game. Holy shit, that did damage. bed i do think this zelda game unlike maybe most zelda games i will absolutely have to chase down every kind of um every kind of piece of healing and every piece of heart because it's oh my god this is brutal you, you just get slapped up We're not even at the point where we need to use elemental resistances, like, to, to counter things, either. Alright, so what am I gonna do to break this? The armadillo, maybe? Dylan's rolling western? Well, it broke the bed, too. I wasn't expecting that. Get them, boys. Okay, most of you are lame. Um, bro, thank you. The golden egg again. I don't know if I could get this one though. Bro. Oh no, Dark Nut. Get him. Tank it. <laughs> Just slap some bonk. Very nice. Car Caramodillo level two. Okay, so there's level two echoes, which means there's probably a dark nut level two. And you know, that's going to be stupidly good. That's what we're praying for. save. It's been a while since we saved, so might as well. Seek two distinct tributes. Clues to the desired tributes are recorded somewhere on this floor. Stands quietly in the sanctum. It is blue in color with large tusks and a long nose. It's an elephant. Okay. Wow, fucking hell.
Alright. Ten portions of rock salt. So we need to find, like, an elephant statue. Here's a Poe. <laughs> wow, he actually defeated the Poe. Or, I'm sorry, the Poe actually defeated the Dark Nut. Basically, most of your teammates are not smart enough to not just walk right into it. Seems to be the lesson there. Like, the AI is intentionally very simple-minded. Map. Hey, look! It's got to be Link, but where is he going? Just ignore him. Fuck it. Just ignore him. This guy is... I don't even know what this fish was doing. I didn't even do anything to it. He's having problems. He's having severe problems. And that's all his own making. I did not do anything to him. rupees. I wonder what the limit is that you can carry. Waypoint has been recorded. You can return here. Okay, gotcha. Get him. Oh, fuck. This is pretty bad. I can't move. Two whole hearts? Oh, this is bad. <sighs> just use the fairy. Yeah, it's, it's just better to use the fairy. They can't kill the dark nut, so we just chill. Now the question is, where do we get a fairy from? You got a monster stone. These strange stones form inside the bodies of monsters. you want to climb down here? I guess it's just a fast way back in. And obviously, we don't want to stop here. Okay, 
We can use a bed and a trampoline as usual. Oh my god, this room is a nightmare. I mean, again, they can't kill him. All they can do is just stun him. Wait till I can summon two level ones. We're gonna be on fire, dude. And we got the basic Gibto one. Echo. Okay, learn. This is a cat statue. This isn't at least the one one of them that we want. to catch me he's too slow so all right let's move on i guess we're gonna have like interior and exterior dungeons at the same time okay you warp you're using the map Grapes. I don't know if I would eat grapes from this place, but hey, it is what it is. Oh, shit. Yeah, well, if he couldn't hurt it, it would be too broken, right? What? Ah, oh, of course. Man, they let him jump. They just let him do everything. <laughs> I guess we have to put the pressure on by using a dark nut, and we run up and slash him ourselves. Oh, that's it. Okay. Never mind. Phase two? Yeah. Okay, that was obviously a little too easy. Alright, so all they really want to do is run away. Alright, they only need two hits, though. But I don't have a ton of energy for that. I just have to figure out how to kill the last one. Here, I'll body block. That is a terrible idea. Hit him. Yeah! Fucking barrel stuffed him. Let's go. Yeah, let's... Because he could just jump out. Hit him again.
Are we gonna have to do five of them now? Okay, no. We have the bow. Is this just like a permanent weapon that we can use? This is like what happened with Facet and your people at the castle. Link was taken by the still world and replaced with an imposter, too. Maybe we could help the real Link by fixing the rift. Got the bow of might. You could fire arrows by pressing X when in sword fighter form. Bed. Oops. I thought. A classic bed bridge. That's a way back. waypoint has been recorded okay so we have more or less everything we need now i don't know if we're going to continue to get upgrades like that i guess we'll get the bombs right so there's like a little bit of traditional zelda gameplay in here right like we'll be able to get some of the stuff that we usually get in a game like this what I made it. I'm on fire. <laughs> I tried to hop on the bed. That's fucking hilarious. <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe the bed will put me out. All right, whatever. Game over. See, it's it's not letting me take the one I want. I want to get rid of the one on the right, and it's making me unlearn the one on the left. Small key. All right, whatever. Just have to pay a two heart penalty. Okay. Honestly, we should try to leave and get a fairy. Like, we're, we're very low on hearts. We're very low on everything. Let's see if we can get anything from this room. That's right, because when you're on fire, the best thing to do is to jump into a bed. You'll be fine. I mean, you know, sometimes in games you get away with that. You get really lucky. I'm safe. Fuck you. So what do we need? A cat on the left and an elephant on the right? Maybe? We know that we need an elephant on the right. I just don't know what's on the left. I don't know if I ever found that, uh, that hint. Okay. 
That is not the direction I wanted at all. What? Maybe it doesn't turn that way. I'll just do it myself. <laughs> Fine, I'll do it myself. It rests its wings atop a tower, bears sharp eyes and a strong beak. So we need an eagle statue on the other one. Good God. This is a dungeon, all right. I guess we could go forward. I guess I didn't do that before. Let's go forward. Apparently there's another entrance as well that we can enter from. Oh no, this is the way forward. Okay. Well, we could at least place the elephant statue. Po, Mothula, Gibdo, Gibdo level two is four, Jesus. How do you get this? Rip, <laughs> rip. Uh, I guess we, yeah, let, let's leave, and then we'll, we'll come back around outside. We could teleport up top outside as well. Okay. Okay. Where's this exactly? This extra entrance? Where the fuck is this? Oh, it's a... Ooh, okay. That's cool. It's a wind... Ah, it's just a treasure room. All right, uh, what room haven't we been to? Because we need to find an eagle statue, and I have no idea where to find one of those. I don't know how to get to this room over here. This is the boss room. I don't know. I guess I gotta start checking every room again. What was a room that had an eagle in it? We just did this room. Right, that was the mini boss room. Oh, the eagle might be out up top. Yeah, that's fair. The eagle might be on the outside. Rested wings atop a tower. We might have to climb up somewhere, and then there's an eagle statue. It might not be inside of here. Elephant statue's worth two. Yeah, okay. Ah, fuck. Surprised that didn't break, actually. Ah, oh, Lord above.
Well, this is gonna take a while. <laughs> Do I even have anything else I could summon that could help? Yeah, one keys. There you go. Oh, God! Thank you. Well, it'll take a minute. He'll do it. Come on, butchers block him. Nice. Find that one. We're already passed. Fuck that guy in particular. Now we can answer. Ooh, release it. Thank you. The hawk statue. Okay. All right. Um. See, here's the thing. Now let's go back in. Yeah, let's let's go back inside. I guess now we can open this door. I don't know if that leads to the other rooms that we haven't found yet. Water in this? Yes. Okay. What is that going to do? Fill the... Oh, it drains the room above. Okay. I guess we can go up... We can go back to that room now. Which is right over here. We can spin the dials. How is this going to work exactly? There we go. We did a game, we had a, a puzzle like that in a game that we played a while, like pretty recently. I forget what game it was specifically. It definitely wasn't Tears of the Kingdom. It was something very similar to this and I remember I was stuck on it for a little bit. But now we missed a treasure. So how do we get into that other room? All right? Did we miss two treasures? No, we just missed the one. Okay, can we get back up there? Type? No. Trampoline. Seriously, one of the best ones. How do you get in here? Oh, uh, you know what it is? There might be, like, some way to get in from the ceiling. Maybe? Let's see. No, I have no idea. I don't know if I want to be stuck here with these dudes. We might just go ahead and we might just finish this. I don't, I don't know if I want to mess around trying to figure out what, what the entrance is and where I can go and stuff to get this. I have no idea how I'm supposed to get it. So maybe I'll just say fuck it. And if we really need to, we can come back later. I get the feeling it's just going to be rupees anyway, which we can make up for. 
So I'm just gonna ignore it. Okay. Oh, I should have healed. Oops, I should have. Yeah. It's kind of annoying. Right. It's a mole. What the fuck? Mole Griff. I did not mean I keep doing that by accident. I think that was the inventory in tears. Phase two. Yeah, he's definitely not done. Don't worry about that. Quicksand. I got a sinking feeling. Nothing changes basically, we just have to survive in the quicksand. It restricts your movement just a little bit. It's not that crippling. Sunglasses. I guess because he's blind, but like, I don't know, it just looks like he's going on like a beach party or something. Very nice. Yeah, I don't know why sunglasses. I, I know, I know, it's because he's blind, but like, it, at first, it's like it looks like he's going for like a party or something. Because they're all like colorful. My friends shared some of their power with me. Well, it's only halfway now. Oh, no, it's a full level up. What the fuck? All right, so every major dungeon we do is a full level up. Gotcha. Whereas every side dungeon is just like a little portion. 
feel like I could do even more now. You could create echoes at a distance. Hold Y. Echo at a distance by pressing and holding Y to charge power. Okay. I don't know how that will be helpful at the moment, but that's a start, I guess. My friends told me something while we were mending the rift. They said that monster captured them. It was the first time something like that had happened to them. Since you defeated the monster, they could get back to work. Not really anything else to do in the still world for now. So let's go back to your world, Zelda. Our container. Yes, let's go. You're back! All the rifts are gone now, including the big one that was here. You did it, Zelda. Everyone in town is awaiting your return. Come on, let's go together. <laughs> Time to celebrate the rifts going away. Come on, it's on me! You're going to come crying to me to help you pay the bill again, aren't you? Just at that moment, a faint shadow of a warrior rose out of the darkness. Eek! Looks like everyone's conveniently forgotten that it's time for training. Oh, come now. This is a time of celebration. The rifts are gone. Training can happen tomorrow. Everyone is in good spirits. Oh, they really are. Ah. Zelda, allow me to express my deepest gratitude. Thank you for helping us. Yes, yes. Thank you so much, Zelda. Because of you, we took decisive action and our desert is saved. I must thank you as well, Dona, my daughter. Your determination and your love for our people have saved this town. Oh, mother. You've grown so much. In fact, I think you are already capable of being chief. What? Not yet, right? I mean, there's still so much I have to learn. Thank you, mother. It feels good to hear you say that. Zelda, you intend to continue traveling and fixing rifts. I will pray for your success. Didn't we get something someone wanted? It turns out your father wasn't here either. But there's still another rift to check out. It's far to the east in a place with lots of water. Let's go take care of that rift now. Someone wanted the flying tile, right? Yeah, here we go. That was at the oasis. Yeah, okay. Okay. Searching for everyone. Whoa! Is this the flying towel that Facet spoke about? You have to show it to me again. Show it to me a bunch. Oh my god. Alright, now that I've seen the tiles with my own eyes, I can share what I've learned with my boss. Thank you, you've been a huge help. Yeah, the usual. Okay. I guess we could buy the quicksand slippers. We don't know if they're if it's gonna really help us. So let's make a point of researching in the ruins, looking for useful things to bring to town. She's so incredibly selfless, I aspire to be like her. I mean, like, we could just really briefly go buy the slippers. I don't know if they're going to help us with anything else, but whatever, we could try. And yeah, that's probably where I'll stop for today. Um, You know, pretty good. I'm enjoying it. It's pretty different. It's very, very different. I don't even know pretty, uh, pretty different even satisfies it. Here we go. I'll buy them. Gerudo sandals. Aww. Thanks. We have to actually equip them. Wow, you can only wear one accessory. So you, you can't wear a pin and shoes. Okay. Uh, Alright. Let's go back here. At least we've learned a lot about this game. Now, when will I play this game? Maybe tomorrow? I have to think about it. I'll see. You're going to probably try to play. I would like to play Final Fantasy tonight. You know, just to mix it up and have like one Final Fantasy video. So I don't have to do two days of this. But I am. It is like 9 o'clock. I'm, I'm going to be honest. I'm a little lazy. So I don't know. Yeah. 
Let's enhance uh, the energy. Sure thing. The energy gauge is now level two. Very nice. Now we need 10. All right, we'll probably do energy next time as well. All right, that's going to be it for today. It's, it's off to a good start. I'm enjoying it. It's hard, but it's off to a good start.